YouTube channel. My name is Namko Senora. If it's your first time to view this channel, you're most welcome. Please kindly subscribe to my channel. Click the bell to turn on the notification. Every time that I upload the new videos, you'll be notified. For those of you who haven't yet subscribed, what are you waiting for? Subscribe to my YouTube channel now to view more channels. For my return beautiful subscribers, I want to say thank you so much, guys. Thank you so much for supporting me and loving me, your girl, Nora. Guys, if you don't know what this channel is all about, it's all about me, Nora. I talk about my lifestyle and I share some cooking tips on this channel. So in today's video, I will be sharing something special that we've never done before on this channel. We'll be preparing something nice and something good. So guys, let's jump into the video. Alright guys, let's go. So guys, for today's what we're going to make, I'm going to make hummus. Hummus is one of my favorite veggies and my dish or oh, my favorite food and my menu, one of the best of the things that I love to eat. So here I have my chickpeas and to make the hummus at home you will need tahina. Tahina is made out of sim sim, it's a pure. There are so many brands out there but for me I'm going to use this. And you need two cloves of uh, garlic and you will need lemon to make it and a, and a blender. We don't have a food processor but we'll be using this and I'm going to open this so let's go. So if you want to see that your hummus is good, the pills uh, the pills will remove by itself, you see, these are what we are trying to remove the skin from the chickpeas so that it will remain pure like this. So this is what I'm trying to do, but if you want you can leave it on, but it's good if you remove the pills from it. So that's what I'm doing right now. And when I'm done, I'll show you the next thing that we will be doing. Let's continue watching. So I don't want to smash them. I'm just going to use my hands like this to fold them. Just massage them. Well, you see, this is what I'm trying to get off. So I'm done with my chickpeas, I'm done with removing the skin, so I'll pour it here in my blender. And you will need salt, don't forget salt. Just a quarter spoon of salt. And dropping your, your garlic. And then, don't forget to add five spoons of tahini in your um, hummus, in your chickpeas. Anyway, you can call it hummus if you want. The way you can enjoy the hummus, you can have it with pita bread, uh, chapati, any bread that's thin or light, that's what you can have it with. So I'm going to add this spoon. One, two, three, four, five. And, put it on and one thing that you shouldn't forget whenever you're making hummus. You shouldn't forget the olive oil. It's so important to put the olive oil in your home. So I'll add in a little, not too much. Because later on when I'm done, I'll be adding on again some olive oil. And then I'll add in some lemon juice. Let me get a straw. So squeeze your lemon juice. Bus. 
now it's time to blend this until it's smooth don't forget we're making hummus today that's what we're going to have for lunch so guys as you can see i'm still beating my hummus and it's in the blender using blender it's so hard if it was a food processor it would have been so easy i would have been finished by like 10 minutes but here we are we're still on the same thing blending and my blender is making too much noise and so guys i'm going to mute while working on my hummus so let's continue blending our hummus when it's ready and smooth i'll show you guys what i was actually making so here's our hummus it's ready so i'm struggling to remove it that's why you see oh, using a blender it's so hard guys but just take a look at it look at my hummus <laughs> Oh, I'm already walking on the sunshine, guys, at the beach while enjoying my favorite. Just so, guys, tell me what do you think about my jacket? That my kimono jacket that I'm wearing. I made this myself. If you guys don't know, some of the clothes I make them for myself, but not this long one. This this was made by my boss. Actually, she's not the one who made it. She took the tailor, but this I made it for myself just for the winter. Let me continue scooping. If you want your hummus to look classic and the hotel hummus, just get the spoon and do it like this, you see? Like this. Ooh. See how it looks? Now, let me test the essence. So, in your hermes, you will need the pepper flakes, a new sprinkle on top. Guys, I learned this in the restaurant. Remember, I used to work in the restaurant. And I remember the chefs, they would kick me out of the kitchen. They tell me, go away. Do you want to steal our, our secret recipe? Why are you always in the kitchen? Waitresses, they are not supposed to be in the kitchen. I told them, I just want to learn. Why are you guys kicking me out? They told me, get out. But still, I managed to get the recipe. You add some olive oil on top of it. And you enjoy your hummus. And then if you have a basil leaves or maybe daniel leaves, you just put on top for the designing, just to design your dish. And if you want lemon to add on top of it, you can. Your lemon juice can just add a little bit of lemon but let me just put it outside because I don't want too much lemon for my teeth just want to keep my teeth safe so right guys this is the moment we've been waiting for this is our hummus and these are the ingredients that you need to make the hummus oh voila so you see how it looks it's yummy soft and we will have with chapati if you want to enjoy your hummus just grab the chapati if you don't have chapati you can get the pita bread pita bread in the form of pita bread they are called uh, lebanese bread so you just have it and you go here we go Go out! I told you to say yummy, you're just... <laughs> now Iman is swallowing it. Mmm, yummy. Is it good? Mm, yummy. Is yummy. it good? Yeah. Okay, so guys, this is what we have here for today. 
this is our homes and that's how it looks so guys i'll be updating my videos every sunday i've changed the program so guys i was saying i'll be updating my videos every sunday that's when i'll be uploading the videos i've changed the program from saturday to sunday due to some things that i've been doing that have been keeping me busy the whole week so i've i've changed the time it will be on sunday every evening that's when i'll upload my videos thank you guys for watching and thank you so much for subscribing to my youtube channel and for my return subscribers thank you so much and i love you guys until i see you next time bye bye have a wonderful sunday have a wonderful saturday evening good afternoon morning bye guys Mwah.